Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I finally am off work. I went in early, got what I needed done, and was able to come home. And I can't tell you the last time I had a day off work. I am a really hard worker and I put 100% into everything that I do besides YouTube because I have no idea how to edit. I didn't take computers in school or anything, so I just kind of wing it. Anyways, I did not know that I was getting another BoxyCharm, so I came home yesterday and I had a BoxyCharm Premium. And honestly, this is the crappiest box I have ever received in my life. I don't think that there is one thing in here that I would use, not one. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got and then I got just a few things from Sephora um, as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start with the BoxyCharm Premium. Um, it's the same thing, BoxyCharm, just like the candy thing. So my last box I got, I had gotten the um, Murad like cleanser. So I got the hydration this time from Murad. Um, if I use this as a toner, I probably, I like sprays for my chest. I'll probably just maybe use that for my chest. Um, next thing is these go-to exfoliating swipeys, foolproof exfoliating pads for glowy skin. Um, and they just look like that. Uh, my husband loves, um, like pads. I'm that person where like I do <laughs> full, like on step by step. I won't use these. So. Then I got this from K-O-S-A-S, Coas, I think it's called. Hi, Tay Tay, and my doggy. Hi, baby, you coming over here? Come in, come in, it's okay. They can't see you, can they? There, they can see you, little bitch. You gonna lay down? He'll probably just lay down and chill with me. He is my emotional support, my ride or die, hi. So, but this is just like a tinted face oil. I don't like oils on my face and I don't even want to try new things on my face because with my luck, I would totally break out and hmm, but we all know how, how that was down. I had opened this. This was from the same brand. I might use this. It's a lip fuel, hyaluronic lip balm. And it just comes in like this little package you open it up and there's no smell to it, but it's just like that. So, um, it's good for your skin. Hi, baby. You want to lay down on the pillow? Lay down here. I can scoot this over. YouTube won't mind. And then the last, oh, I got two other things. They sent me this. It's just two eyeliners that I tried this morning and like they didn't even apply. Like literally, this is premium. Then I got this palette, and these are not colors that I would wear. This is way out of my zone. Um, I guess it's good for Halloween. I don't know, but yeah. So that's what I got in my premium box. Was not excited, total waste of money. Um, it's just really frustrating. Like I feel like BoxyCharm just gets bored and just throws things in there and they're not putting Come here, baby. Any effort into anything that they're doing. But I did get a few things from Sephora. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. Um, one I opened because I ran out. And we all know my ride or die is my Tatcha Indigo Cream. So this is the box right here. I just had ordered this. And I it came in like the day I ran out. And I was like, thank you, Lord. <laughs> Indigo Cream. This is just my baby. Like best cream in the world if I could only use one one product for like the rest of my life this would probably be it next is this has been on sale for god knows how long it's the Natasha Denona um tropical palette so I was like well why not it came in like a big box I was like I'll get it get some fun this is about as fun as I'll get unlike that other brand but this is really really cute um I really kind of like this Tiger Lily. It's like a deep purplish blue, but um, I actually really do like this palette. I think the packaging is gorgeous. It's fun. Um, yeah, so I'm super excited to try that. 
Next thing I got was the Hourglass um, Ambient Sculpting thing. I don't know much. I've never tried um, their products before. And um, I thought that this was going to be like full size. It was, I paid $80, $80 for this. And they're like minis. They're like so small. And I'm like, I don't think that I would use this. So I'm probably going to end up returning it. Um, I thought it would be nice to have for traveling since I am so far from home. And when I do go home, I fly home anyways. So that was like a no-go. Um, just was not excited. Then I saw that the Kat Von D was on sale. The palette. So I was super excited. I grabbed it. And then I opened it up because I was super excited. Ugh. I can never open things. I said, I quit. I'm done. Okay, so I open it and it is cream. I thought it was powder. I cannot use cream on my face. Total waste. I'm telling you, I just have not hit the jackpot. This is jackpot. This is kind of me like ranting on my stupid purchases that are just crap. And then along with all the rest of that, um, I got like an empty shade light palette, which is awesome because I can actually go in that and just create my own and put them in here and I don't have to worry about it not being powder. I just don't like cream. I don't, I don't, I'm so oily as you can see. Like I have a little bit of powder on, but that is about it. And then um, for, I got like two of these or three of these, these little Givenchy, Givenchy, like lip glosses, which are super cute and I'll probably throw in my purse. I did order some, um, Pat McGraw, dude, I don't know, but they were like these little eyeshadows and I love gold, gold eyeshadow, like anything gold bronzies are going to be like my favorite, like that copper tone. So I got two of those coming and then um, I'm still waiting on the Pure Cosmetics um, Barbie line. I ordered that and I ordered almost the whole collection. So I'm super excited. Maybe it'll make up for my crappy boxy charm. And then like these orders, like why did I... And returning them is just like a pain in the butt because anytime you go to Sephora, they're so rude. Oh my goodness. If I work at Sephora, I would be like the nicest person. Like you should always tell somebody they're beautiful. You should always smile at somebody. Try to make their day. I don't know. But every time I go in there, it's like, what can we help you with? And I'm just like, I don't need your help. You need my help. I mean, look, look at my wings. Come on now. Anyways, that was it. So basically, out of everything that I got, like the only thing I like is my Natasha Denona palette. But um, when I get the rest of my stuff in, I'll definitely let you guys know. Um, that's literally about it. Um, this might be the worst BoxyCharm um, box that I've ever received, especially for premium. I mean, that is pathetic. My base box was way better than my premium. And what you pay more for, so you think that your products should be better. Why are you waving at me? No I'm in the middle of filming. Go away. What happens when your child walks in the room? <laughs> just starts waving at you. He's nine year old, nine years old, and he's on like a little break from school online. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this palette. I have no clue what were the other things that you could have gotten like in your um, BoxyCharm premiums. But um, honestly, um, I will probably give most of that away. I have a whole box um, and I just give stuff away. Um, I'm a military spouse and uh, I have a whole box. So sometimes I'll just give stuff away to some military wives or people who just can't afford things. Um, and I just let people go through it and let them get what they want. Um, or if not, I'll take it to work. I work here on base and I could take it to my coworkers and, um, see if uh, there's anything that they want or need. Um, I just really need to go through my stuff. I did just donate a whole bunch of stuff. Um, 
I'm trying not to have a lot of makeup. So if I use something, I just kind of want that. Like, I don't mind trying new things. I mean, that's fine. But um, with, with my skincare, I've learned that I, I just have to stick with what I know. And I cannot be testing out products. So I have a bunch of things that work for me. But they work for me. So I don't know if they would work for anyone else. Um, skin is just trial and error. You know, you'll break out and then you got to figure out, you know, what works for that. Um, I'm 31 years old, so I'm in my 30s. So I try to take care of myself the best that, um, I can. But this cream I use for my eye cream, it's hair on it <laughs> and, um, everything else. So yeah, that's it. So my next video will be my Barbie video. And I'm super, super excited. Hence my Barbie tattoo that I don't know if you can see. But anyways, I love you guys. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.